we have some great confirmation about the trailer release date and a lot more in this entire video we're gonna take a look at the latest loot bomb which actually shows us so much cool stuff and there were such great leaks of the new game kingdom of alliance so stay tuned till the end and let's begin They start off by telling us that the hogs or the wild beasts have attacked the camp which is actually being run by Westpool which we saw in the last video of the sneak peeks I guess make sure to check it out if you haven't but that is the news we get and we get a actual footage from in game how actually things will look like so that's pretty cool and we get to take a look at these creatures I mean they're like the more big version of the hogs and they were always ready to rumble and they seem to be a lot more chaotic i guess so that's pretty like i i like the art style it's more of vengeance kind of art style but in the engine of the first three games or first four games if you want to say so that's pretty interesting i'm really looking forward to see more of it watch till the end the date is finally released i would like to call these the wild barrows i guess because they are they seem to be having a raging power as they will when low they just rage and attack they seem to be very tanky by their looks and stuff and that is pretty cool to be honest i'm really looking forward to see how we can actually do this will this be the part of the game i have no idea but this seems to be because once they defeat these wild beasts that they are going to be able to finally start their quest as put it's written in the lore bomb they gave a small sneak peek to the new actual towers i guess so there are four types of upgrades in the entire tower so tower system is going to be like the vengeance which is pretty much confirmed and this is like the first kingdomish game towers which are the paladins if i'm right i really do not remember but yes there are archers who wield too they look a lot different if i'm gonna be honest and so do the actual soldiers or whatever they call them but they seem different and I really do not mind with it because of course it should be looking different after so many years so I like this and I still have not seen any army from the dark army so I'm really looking forward to see that because I am a lot more interested in the dark army because I'm a dark army fan let me know when which side do you support and now the thing we all have been waiting for 4th April is the day where we are gonna get the trailer by whatever means that is confirmed we'll get the trailer on 4th April and as per I predicted in the last video it was around May or June but they're releasing it pretty much soon so the game date should be the actual release of the game should be in 2024 as they said and i have a good gut feeling that it should be in may or it will be around late of 2024 i really do not know but that's just a prediction it's a just the game theory now the q a which we all have been waiting for so what is the actual timeline as per this guy asked agent asked as they said there is not an exactly how or when the overseer came and there was not like the uh, dimension how his followers once this came out nobody knows about it so don't ask about it. and the question by anton is were gnolls related to the wild beast and the question is yes not completely but they are the distinct relatives of them and they don't seem to be getting along with each other Will Xin and Dante come back to vanquish evil? No, but they might be partially lying, so that's us. Will Wesleyan ever do a face reveal? There are two things Wesleyan would never do. Reveal his face to carpenters and wear socks with a sandal because that's too evil for him. Well, that is all gonna be all for this entire video. If you enjoyed it, make sure that subscribe button with notifications on because when I post the next video, you will get notified with it. And we'll stay tuned on 
April 4th. And we will get the news and I'll break down the entire trailer. So make sure you subscribe for that. I'm really happy for this game. I'm really excited. My childhood game is actually getting a new series. How can I not be excited for this? And that is going to be me, Prawn, signing out of this one. And don't forget.